Hi everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download Postgres uh, advanced server provided by EDB, uh, which is Enterprise DB. Uh, this uh, Postgres advanced server has the support of Enterprise DB. And uh, if you want to go in this route, uh, you have to check the plans available uh, for advanced server configurations. And there are several plans available. You can uh, choose one for uh, whatever suits for your need. And if you want to download and play with it uh, and how to install it and see how the Postgres advanced server works, you can go to downloads. <coughs> and then there are other tools available here provided by Enterprise DB. And in this case, we are interested about EDB Postgres Advanced Server. And you click this arrow. And then there are versions available. The latest version available right now is version 12. And also depends on the platform that you are going to install the Advanced Server. I'm going to choose the Linux platform, uh, supports for CentOS 8.0 and other versions. And you click on Access Repo. And then, actually, if you have not already registered or signed up uh, for this repository in EDB, so you have to sign up first and then you will get into this 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 screen since i'm already signed up uh, it is already showing this screen so you can go with yum repository and the other options for debian and selenis and ubuntu i'm i'm interested on the yum repository method so i'm gonna click that and you will get this screen and here you select the platform i'm planning to install this on centos 8 so i'm going to select centos 8 here and as i mentioned earlier these are the other available products by edb like pg admin and postgres enterprise manager especially the postgres failover manager provided by edb which gives you high availability uh, in this video, I'm going to download EDB version 12. When you click that, the right side of the screen, you will see the instructions on how to uh, how to get this installed in your machine. So you can just copy and paste and you can simply execute this. But in my experience, I have, I have seen you have to do little more additional steps than this. And in my next video, um, I will I will show you that how to install this Postgres Advanced Server 12 on CentOS 8 box. And thanks for watching. Thank you very much. Bye.